Today we are at the Villages, and this is going to be kind of a repeat video, kind of not. Um, I went back and looked at some of our previous videos, and we did this one a long time ago, Bonefish Grill, and it was only a three minute video. Definitely wasn't detailed like we normally do, so we thought, we haven't been back since. Let's go back to Bonefish Grill and do a full review this time. Also, we will be with my parents so we can see some more items and kind of just give you a rundown of what it looks like in there. It is a chained restaurant. We're just at this one at the Villages. Also, while I'm thinking of it, um, we did get a reservation online, super easy to do on their website. We did it for 545 and you can sign up for like some rewards, which first time signer uppers get like $10 off. We have already been a signer upper, so you can just collect points. It's starting to thunder. It's gonna rain, I think, so we're gonna hurry inside. Let's go check it out. Ooh, it's gonna rain soon. Wonder if we should grab the umbrella. This is low, should we, you think? Uh, I don't know. Or just risk it. We're just gonna risk it. Bonefish Grill is located off 466 right here. Uh, it's by, we've done a video at Home Goods, so Home Goods is kind of over that way. Um, our reservation is for in five minutes, and it looks like my parents are sitting outside right now. Try to get a view of the hours on the door. I think last time we showed that, but we'll show it again. All right, it shows hours Monday through Thursday, 11 to 10, Friday through Saturday, 11 to 11, Sunday, 10 to 9, bar open till it doesn't say, and there's a nice waiting area right here. We're gonna go in and show you the inside. Look at this door handle. And this is what it looks like in here. We have a bar right here and seating. Restrooms are in the far corner. And we'll tell them that we had a reservation. Although at 545, I feel like you actually don't need a reservation on a, it's currently a Tuesday. And then back again by that blue wall is where the restrooms are. I think we're actually gonna be in a booth at the bar area. There's also a little seating area right in here, but we are coming this way and we will be right here. So social hours, three to 6.30 every single day and it's 5.45. So here are some cocktails, spirits, and wines and drinks that you can get. And then on this side, they've got social hour, all oh, that little thing's heavy there. Social hour for starters and small plates. And then here is the August 2023 kind of specials. So let it snow crab, ooh. Partners selection, crab and Old Bay butter grouper. That sounds good. Daily summer specials, handcrafted martinis and cocktails. So I guess maybe they switch these out every month. Let's have a look at the menu. So on this side we have kind of the drink menu with the signature martinis, wines, um, handcrafted cocktails. Kind of just go through here. Ask us, we'll craft your favorite cocktail. Oh, well, that's good. All these wines on the left-hand side, beers, desserts, classic cheesecake, that's, that's solid. Warm cookie, macadamia nut brownie. And then over here, they've got some beverages. I think last time I got their tea maybe, and their tea was very good. So that's what I'll be getting again. Um, it looks like they could po possibly do a Arnold Palmer, which I might do. I might do an Arnold Palmer. Oh yeah, because it's Gold Peak tea. Of course it's good. So that is the drink side. Then this is the menu side. So we have from the bar right there. We also have starters and sharing. I've had someone um, back in Missouri say they love the Bang Bang Shrimp. And I don't think we've, we've gotten that before, so that's always an option. If you've been to a Bonefish Grill, comment below on what your favorite thing to get here is. Um, there's soups and greens from the wood-fired grill. And as we go down, perfect pairings. That's served with two signature sides. Down here we've got pick your side, so you've got premium side, so a little bit more of a, of a cost with those. And you can get them a la carte. They do have those Brussels sprouts. Mm. There's the signature sides. 
Um, the little starfish represents a bonefish girl favorite. And then we have from the sea and from the land and from the dock. So that is their menu. It looks like they've got a really good menu. Just another pass over again. Not sure what we're gonna get yet here. So I think Timur and I are gonna share a few things here. I'm not sure what, but the crab legs sound very good. They said that is a, a fairly new um, selection they have. I think we need to try, I would like to try the bang bang shrimp, but also down here, those Brussels sprouts. That sounds good. Um, I think my dad's getting fish and chips and my mom's getting the scallops, I think. Possibly looking at something from this, from the wood-fired grill. Maybe like sharing the scallops and shrimp skewer and you can get them crafted with any of these signature sauces. And that does come with two signature sides. Definitely thinking the whipped potatoes will be one of those. And then we might add a pick your sides. Thank you. Oh, and they just brought bread and pesto and oil. All right, we made an audible like we always do, but I want to try the bang bang shrimp sometime. But what we're going to do is the scallops and shrimp skewer. Do you know what sauce you want? Huh? Lemon butter? Sure. What's the lemon caper butter? I don't know the difference. Caper taste, olive Oh, I don't care either one of those. And then the two sides are gonna be garlic whipped potatoes, seasonal vegetables, and then we're gonna add a side of the bacon, mac, and cheese. Now I went with the Arnold Palmer with unsweet tea. We're gonna give this bread a little bit of a dip here. Bread. That's pretty tasty bread. It's good with the oil and seasoning on there. I think it is pesto. I think she said it was pesto. And here is the tea. That's good. That's good tea. I guess it's all you can eat bread because she said, you want to bring, you want me to bring you some more? And we said, yes. So here's a look at the fish and chips. Looks good. And then we essentially got the same thing, but you got that little, an extra sauce there. And then here's ours, and they said they would split it for us. We're just waiting on, my mom had coleslaw, and we also had the bacon mac and cheese, so that's what we're waiting on. But they did split it for us, which is awesome. Mashed potatoes first. Those are very good mashed potatoes. They're good. Good mashed potatoes. Let's try the broccoli. Broccoli's cooked good. It's not like super crunchy, which is good. You're trying the, what is that? The lemon caper butter. Lemon caper butter with a scallop. How is it? Okay. Which, the butter stuff or the scallop? How was the scallop? Really get, get in there with that butter. Get more on there. It's mostly lemon. Mostly lemon? And then we've got the salsa to try also size of the scallop lemon sauce the scallop has a good like wood burning fire taste to it it's really good I couldn't really tell much with the lemon sauce um, let's try the mango with the shrimp I like the mango sauce better than the lemon sauce um, yeah this is the what was it though Pan Asian sauce. Give it a try. That's pretty good. It's really not spicy. It's like a teriyaki ish flavor. We've been handed a fry or a chip. Ooh, they're hot for the test. Ow, they're hot. Not super crunchy. Ow, they're hot. Not crunchy. That's for sure. They're not crunchy. But let's try it. Temperature hot. It's just a typical chip, typical fry. All right, they just brought the bacon mac and cheese and this is what it looks like. So we're gonna give that a try. Looks good. Pretty good sized portion of it too. Look at the steam. Here we go. It's a very good flavor. And that's really good mac and cheese. How's the mac and cheese? It's tasty, right? So we finished our meal. How many, one, two, three, four, like five shrimp, I guess, or so? And then we're working on the mac and cheese now. All right, that was plenty for us to share. We are pretty full. Everything was good. 
Thank you. All right, we are heading back outside. It did rain, now it's sun's out. Although it did cool down, so that's, that's great news. Great news that it cooled down. All right, that was our trip out to Bonefish Grill here at the Villages. I would say the only negative I got out of this was it took a while, it took over an hour. It's like 6.50 or so right now. The food did take a while to actually get. It was busy. Um, it was busy though. So earlier I said you might not need a reservation. Later in the evening, you might need a reservation, but I hope this video was better than, oh, I can't stand on the curb there. I hope this video was better than our last video. If you've never been to Bonefish, it gives you an idea of what that's like. And then if you have been to Bonefish, just comment below on what's your favorite thing to get. Maybe next time we will try it. We shared plenty of food. If we didn't have the mac and cheese, probably wouldn't have been enough for me. Um, but adding the mac and cheese really helped us have enough for both of us. Probably could have got dessert, but I'm, I'm at a comfortable level. Um, what was your favorite thing? Um, the shrimp. Shrimp? Yeah. The broccoli was good too. Yeah. Um, ma mashed potatoes, top notch for me. I really liked them. And the seafood, everything was good. My parents liked it. Uh, other than that, we hopefully have a good review now at Bonefish Grill. So with that being said, that does it for today. Thanks for watching.